Today, the city of Juarez and Chihuahua state officials honored the 12 officers who were killed in the recent days. Their families gathered in that ceremony, too, to also mourn the deaths of their loved ones. ABC 7's Eriberto Perez had the chance to be at the ceremony and files this report. With the flag at half a staff, the city of Juarez paid tribute to the dozen of police officers who lost their lives in a series of attacks in recent days. Now authorities are seeking justice for those fallen. Sobre todo, que haremos justicia. No se va a quedar esto así. Haremos justicia. The state attorney general, along with other local and state leaders, paid their respects to the families of the officers who were killed this week. After the prison break on New Year's Day and a shooting on Monday, 12 police officers were killed. Still, no arrests have been made. Mexican law enforcement is now looking for the suspects. On Tuesday, a total of 191 inmates were transferred to different federal government prisons. Authorities want to prevent another violent attack by sending them across Mexico. Chihuahua Governor Maru Campos was also at the ceremony. Hoy tomamos ese dolor y esa frustración e impotencia. She says that now the state will use pain and that frustration as fuel to keep working to find justice for the fallen officers. Que descansen en paz nuestros valientes elementos. And Governor Campos added that finding the people responsible for the 12 deaths are a huge responsibility for the state. And those in power, they will continue to spread resources to keep both the city and the state safe after what happened. Reporting from Ciudad Juarez, Heriberto Perez, ABC7. And after Monday's shooting in Juarez, no more incidents have been reported by authorities connected to the prison's break-in. On Tuesday, hundreds of Mexican Army members arrived in Juarez to reinforce security.